thank you very much for giving this opportunity to speak on the railway budget. First, I would like to congratulate the railway minister who has presented a practical and pragmatic budget. Instead of dwelling on populism, the factors responsible for misery inflicted on the railways in the earlier years. The four goals of cleanliness, safety, modernization of infrastructure, and making the railways financially self-sustainable are most appropriate and well-conceived. The use of technology to provide innovative facilities to passengers and greater attention to women's safety, senior citizens, and persons with disabilities are welcome. On the whole, it is growth-oriented budget, and one can say that the Modi Express has steamed off in the right direction. Having said that, I would like to bring to notice of uh, Honorable Minister certain demands, demands concerning my parliamentary constituency where I represent. Mathura is an ancient city and also a pilgrim center which attracts lakhs of devotees every day. Mathura Junction is an important railway station of western Uttar Pradesh. There are trains moving in seven directions from Mathura Junction. Passengers of Mathura, Alwar, Hathras, Aligarh, Bareilly, and nearby areas board train to western and southern India from Mathura Junction. Though it is an important pilgrim center, Mathura has remained neglected on the Indian Railways map. Basically, my demand relates to stoppage of trains of, at Mathura Junction, Bhuteshwar, and Kosi Kala Railway Station, the details of which I will lay on the table of the house. My demand also relates to setting up of a Zonal Railway Training Institute of North Central Railways at Mathura, rail coach factory, or any other manufacturing unit of railways at Mathura, as well as a container depot, so that the employment opportunities in Mathura may be increased. As you are aware, Mathura is an important pilgrim center. Lacks of devotees throng Mathura every day. Old people, children, women, and physically disabled people come to Mathura to fulfill their desire for the benefit of these people, and more particularly for women, children, aged, and physically disabled, I demand the following. Revival of the train between Mathura Junction and Lucknow at, at daytime, like Shatabdi Express, I'm told that there was such train earlier in the name of Atal Bihari Vajpayee, which has been discontinued. Upgradation and modernization of Rindavan station, cleanliness of railway stations at Mathura, and provision of drinking water and sanitation, adequate toilet facilities for women passengers. Provision of escalators and ramps for old and physically challenged passengers. Giving heritage look to the Mathura station. And lastly, there is a beautiful rail bus known as Radha Rani Express, which is now having only one coach. This train may be made popular by providing more coaches for the convenience of pilgrims as well as the local people, and it can also avoid the traffic jam, which is happening very badly. With these words, I conclude and support the rail budget Welcome. of 2015 and 16. Thank you so much.